In this video, I'm going to show you how you can transfer files wirelessly over to your Netgear D7000 router via FTP. So the Netgear D7000 can be used as a media server. You can upload files to a USB stick or a USB hard drive which is plugged into the router and then watch them onto your smart television. Rather than unplug the USB stick or the hard drive and then plug it into your PC and upload all the files, you can do all, all of this completely wirelessly if you want to. So. To do this, we're going to need uh, two things. First of all, we're going to need to get into the router settings to get the, the appropriate details. And you'll also need a FTP program such as FileZilla. So I'll be using FileZilla for this demonstration. This is a free download. I will also put this link in the description. It's pretty simple to use. So we'll look at this program in a little minute. So what we need to do is open up a web browser. Any web browser will do and type in routerlogin.net to get into the into the router's um, interface. If this doesn't work for you, you can also find some details on the back of the router or on the underside of the router. And just log in with admin and the password that you set when you first signed up. If you don't know your password, you will have to probably do a complete reset and start over again. So once you're on the main page, simply click on Ready Share. You can see it down here or you can see it on the um, left hand side. So just click on either one. So once you're on Ready Share, you need to click on on Edit, and they make sure that your USB hard drive or your USB stick is plugged into the router. Click on Edit, and you should see some details then about the particular device. So what we want to do is use FTP. So we can choose either one here, the bottom ones, either this one here or this one here. So basically, we need to copy the address. So for example, if I copy this one here, copy that and then what we want to do is to go back to our FTP program such as FileZilla so so what you can do you can either enter the details up here such as the host the username and password and quickly connect or you can click on file and you can select site manager and you can simply select new site and you can add all the details so I've already added some details so you can see here I've called it router and what I've done here is enter the details. You don't need to enter the FTP and so on. It should automatically format even if you kind of um, delete that and you paste all that into there. That should kind of format itself. But you can de um, delete the shares and the FTP and the slashes from the end. The port is 21, but you can usually leave that blank. Your um, encryption to select only use plain FTP. Login type is normal. Your username will be your your username will be admin, and password will be the password you set up. So once all that's entered, select connect, and hopefully it should connect. So if you never used files as before, everything on the left hand side is your PC, and everything on the right hand side is your USB device plugged into your D7000 router. So you can see here is my USB stick. You can also, if you want to, right click on that, and you can select create a directory. And you can create different kind of files or directories, such as movies. So, for example, I created the movie folder here. I've already uploaded some movies. So, if I wanted to upload a movie from my PC over to the router, all I simply do is select the list up here. So, for example, select videos, then select the destination where your videos are stored. So there's my movies. So if I select the movie folder. So if I wanted say to transfer Blade Runner over to my USB stick plugged into my router, simply um, left click, hold it down and simply drag it over to here, release. And you can see down the bottom here it shows you that the file is being transferred over to the USB stick plugged into the router. Now this may take anywhere from you know 10 to 20 seconds to several minutes depending on the actual speed of your USB hard drive or USB stick that is plugged into your router. So just be patient. Okay, that particular video file has now been transferred from my PC to the Netgear D7000 router USB stick. So basically, just remember everything on the left-hand side here is all your files and folders on your PC. 
and everything on the right hand side is the USB device, all your hard drive and so on. So basically, you know, if I close FileZilla and just um, reopen it, all I literally have to do every time now I want to log into the router is to click on this little icon here and then select the router or the name you gave your login details and it just quickly logs in and all you have to do is simply drag and drop the files from your PC over to the USB stick or hard drive plugged in so really it's as simple as that and once everything's been uploaded you can then use the media server if you have a smart television you just select the, the source button and you can look for the, the particular files or video files and pictures and music and play them onto your smart television so that's how you do it thanks for watching